What's going on YouTube family? This is Asinosis here coming at you with another City of Final Fantasy Opera Omni video. I know I am super late on this and for that I do apologize. I am working even well more hours. I had to adjust my schedule for Furian to, to give him some more support. I did do this fight already. I am going to do my best to do it the exact same way. I don't remember it at all. I should have just recorded it live but I was a bit inebriated so I somehow managed to get this done in 62 turns and yes you can see my rem is not purple she is in fact zero out of three for both her weapons and her armor um so yeah let's get the show on the road <laughs> we'll see if i can pull this off again in the exact same time it's realistically uh rem is kind of there yes to heal but also just to get the um the, the turn swapping out and I did actually go ahead and use one of these. I know some people kind of saved all four uses for the end. I opted not to. Let's see. Awakening has kind of some fun turn shenanigans. I do believe is part of why I made it so quickly. But I don't want to burn through all of them, obviously. And realistically getting broken did not seem to matter all that much. Right? We'll go ahead and use another one though. Because I, I, I do recall I was aggressive as hell. Like absolutely aggressive. Getting through the, these these dickheads especially, I feel, is important because they're just a bunch of assholes. Perfect. Down with the sickness. Um, yeah, we're going to go with Machina again. Get that Furious Blades out. Want to knock them down as much as possible. As quickly as possible. Now we don't need to... Go to that now. Aw oh, man. You're going to pull them shenanigans on me? Okay. Whatever. Yeah, I get. I mean, this is this is very aggressive. So don't don't get me wrong. Like, I'm playing the aggressive ball game. Not necessarily a ball game that I would recommend playing, but it worked in my favor. As because as you guys saw, like I legitimately finished in 62 turns. This is the only team I could have possibly used. My Sid is not built for this at all. I kind of on, I'm on this plan where even some of my fav favorites, uh, just being cognizant of what I have available to me, I am going to have to refrain on doing some of those pools. Okay. Oh boy, this is. Hmm. Oh, she doesn't even have her devoted heart buff. All right, we'll, we'll fix that. Go ahead and get that buff out. I forgot about that buff. That is fairly important. I should have hit, hit that on A, but that's okay, because he's not going to break him. He's simply not, and then he's just going to get countered and smacked. Smack, smack, smackaroo. Now, this is the key drawback for having Rem not purpled. I actually was considering going ahead and and purpling her for this so-called showcase, just to kind of... Um, well, mostly because I was concerned that I would not be able to do it in the 62 turns that I did. Um, but then I thought about it, and I was like, you know what? No, um, if I show you guys... That this is absolutely possible to do 
in 62 turns, or even just without Rem being purpled, it's pretty helpful, I would say. Because then you guys can see the strategy. Alright, um... I honestly do not remember how quickly I got out of this wave the last time. But he is no longer going to do his follow-up attacks on A. So that means that I need to go ahead and put a bit pressure on... Oh, perfect timing for B. Because this one will have a follow-up attack. Possibly kill him. Which then means he can work on A, or Vaughn can work on A, do a red spiral to refresh that buff, and kill him. And I would say that the free use for Machina after he uses his EX is absolutely worth being used on uh, Awakening. I forgot to showcase my arts, but um, my arts on Machina actually aren't bad. I don't. I think I have maybe one perfect art or near perfect art. And yeah, we're gonna definitely LD. And of course, I have not bloomed him yet. Keep forgetting about it. Y'all already know. <laughs> Y'all know how bad I am about blooming. I always forget that shit. Okay, I think that I bursted roughly at about half and then summoned. I don't remember. See, now I really wish I would have recorded this live. Got Rem. Rem does a good job. Okay. So you smacked me in the face a little bit. Oh good. Ooh, I don't wanna I don't wanna cure on the next one though. Oh no 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 no. Alright, we're gonna do this. Not that he really needs it, but this being somewhat aggressive with these helps. Alright, um uh... That's right. Push your ass back full. Yeah, and then I want to swap to Machina. Okay. And then... Is Awakening at... Is it nine stacks? Like in the turn spacings here. Okay, yeah. Furious Blades plus... Give him... Turn Manipulation. Rem can go ahead and heal herself. And then Machina can... Honestly, it's not worth it. It's really not worth it yet. So I'm gonna go with the... Hard damage here. Yep. And then with Vaughn, let's, uh, let's try and blind, um, let's blind A because Rem is not going to get broken, obviously. Okay, it didn't work, unfortunately. That's okay. <laughs> of course, of course B misses. See, this is where Vaughn's um, abilities come in. I'm gonna play for sure. Ooh, that's really good timing, actually. Break. Yes, sir. All right, and then I do believe I 
this. I believe they do some kind of HP attack of sorts. Um, but we're not going to let them intimidate us. One of the things that I really should have thought to do before coming here is making sure that all of my stuff is, of course, equipped. As far as passives go. Yep, that's like straight. Yep. Nobody got broken, so we're good. Mocking the gains even more. Okay. I know you think you're cool and all, but you're really not. Now... Yeah, Rem does not have any Brave to play with. It's again, Machina. And then... We're gonna push, be back. Why is it so blurry? Okay, and who can we? Now oh, I guess it doesn't really matter. They're all bo they're both going for the same. They're both going for my poor Vaughn. He will be fine though. such danger okay for this I will actually go ahead and take the free heal and then ooh. all right don't think here Because this is a dangerous spot to be in. Machina's going to have to LD. You know what? We're going to go ahead and summon here. Because it's actually a great time for Machina to refresh his LD attack. Um, and then we have the freedom to, of course, manipulate the turns. And then, yep, he's going to refresh the LD. Okay, and then we will go definitely with Awakening. I want to try and capitalize on him, get, him getting more turns in the, in the summon is actually fine. I am pretty sure this happened last time too. Okay. That's perfect actually because that means B will get pushed back. Not gonna burst yet, but I will burst soon ish. I will burst when they're both under 50% probably. And just go ahead and cyclone drive. Yeah, 
it would be kind of amusing if I were on track to beat this even faster than last time. Um, yeah, we're not gonna. We don't. We're not in danger as of right now. To need to. Because he's got basically two uses of LD left. And yes, let's swap for Machina. I might be being just a little too aggressive. You can tell some of his damage starts to kind of drop a little bit. Okay. Realistically, it would help a lot if there were... Um... Ooh. They're both attacking her... So here's what we're going to do. Let's get Machina again. There's a trend. Yeah, like Machina absolutely destroys in this LC. Like his LD is very, super strong. It's so good. And we are actually at the point where... Should I go ahead and burst now? I think so. I think we're ready. First, let's do the Vaughn extra action. Then we'll burst. Okay, now, yep, that's Earth and Eruption. Ooh, nice. I was not. I forgot that they were set up for a launch. Okay, and then we just kind of. How's his attack buff looking? Uh, it's looking good. All right, we go white world to our heart's content. Oh, another launch. I mean, won't be more damage, but they will save up some brave, so that's cool. Okay. Oh, you know, let's push you back into the turn void, so to speak, and then let's uh. Work on blinding your ass. Excellent. Oh, what do you know? Let's push you back now. Um, attack did not go down. Nope. Nope. Okay. But let's go ahead and use this red spiral because we're already on white roll plus. That was not that great, but I mean, it's okay. Alright, which one should we smack in the face? Let's go with B. Why not? B's a bitch. <laughs> I'm actually very behind on content in this game, like, I'm usually done with pretty much everything fairly early on, and I still need to do, what is this, I don't even actually recall what that actually does, um, but I still need to do the story chapter, and on hard mode, nice, the blind hits. And she cannot fall. Oh my god, yes. That's an HP attack. Or I thought it was. Come on, drugs. There might be. He's got one use of that left. For awakening a little bit of awakening longer. Alright, we're going to we're gonna bust some turn shenanigans. I'm gonna laugh if I actually get this done even faster. Hey, yep, break can't fall too low. So I like to see. A, B, C. It's as easy as one, two, three. And then, yep. Because of them shenanigans. Now, I do actually think that last time I put more on uh, Vaughn. Just because he does also insane damage. Okay. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. 
I don't know who I want to smack in the face here, but I definitely don't want to waste a burst ability. Oh, of course. Okay, yeah, this is where Machina absolutely has to swap or be swapped for. Because if not, then I am screwed. And then we will have bad days. Okay, first, oh, yeah, we're gonna go for B. Yep. Absolute perfection. How is her... So her devoted heart is close to falling off. an eruption. Refresh that. And because we have the burst effect going, that's cute. Oh, perfect. Because she actually could use um, a heal moment. Yep. He's going to counter. Um... So what's that first buff? Piercing power, I forget where that comes from. Now... HP is fairly high, so let's go here. And he's still gonna LD. Um, we have... Here. And... We're safe to go for... I don't know why I'm peering at my phone when I have a bigger screen in front of my face. Uh, hmm. We don't need a LD yet. Hmm. Although, you know what? Let's just do it. Oh, nice. Perfect. Oh, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. If I seriously get done faster than last time, <laughs> I'm gonna shit myself. Because that is exactly what we're on track for. Yeah, B has a little bit more health. And again, I need to stress this. This is a 0 out of 3 REM team. Can't stress that enough. <laughs> well, there's one down. And it's about to be two. Yep. Oh, shit. Didn't break. That's okay. I got something for you. It's called that big DPS. <laughs> oh, oh shit! Holy fuck! You know it must be the power of Donatello because. Faster. Holy Jesus. Well, there you have it, folks. I mean, 
the the video itself is over 20 minutes long partially because you know i talked through it and talked about what i was doing and my my thought process would i probably be able to do it even faster if rem was purple yes largely in part due to her damage would be even higher so that being said it makes a huge huge difference um whether or not like granted she's mainly there just to swap the turns and keep the heals up and everything and as you can see i did even better no hp damage taken you know at the end 57 turns so five turns faster i, I, I had i refined something else i probably would have finished even quicker anywho uh hope you guys enjoyed and this is nasty asty signing off